Hi guys. Well, on this episode of Wrenching On It, we're going to be working on this 2006 Mitsubishi Raider. So follow along with us and see what we can get done. Have fun. It's okay. It's just getting there. Let down. Good for your lever. Oh, stand it and put down the deck thing. Get over there, man. Safety first. Always. That's good, Wayne. That's good. We're on them. Oh. Oh, that one's a bolt. Okay. <laughs> Not a nut? No, I was really expecting another nut. <laughs> Watch yourself, will you? I gotta slide over that way. Uh, Will, grab me a flathead screwdriver, would you? Sure. Hey, Sean. I'm a tool guy. Yeah, go ahead. You need a little one or a big one, Sean? A long one with a long one with a decent size head. That's it. I'd prefer not to push it out. <laughs> you'll go twice as wide, but you'll be thinner. That's it. <laughs> Held me up for the wrong wheelchair. He sent me in a wheelchair real Am I easy. Bothering yeah. you? Can you see? I sat down oh, yeah. in the entranceway for a half hour. The old lady walked by. It works. It's been here for years. Yeah. And I'd be in tears because I was in so much pain. Yep. 
Right away, she got on, got her little phone right off and blew it over the loudspeaker. <laughs> the emergency room come right down, took me right. The first two shots he gave me didn't do <laughs> And I had to wait an hour in between each one. Well, the doctor came in and gave me what I was used to getting a hold of. Use the girl that in there. I was like, man, I got. I couldn't be in the pain I was. I couldn't. I was there. I, I, I couldn't move. <laughs> anyway, you want to grab one of the floor jacks? Floor so I can pull my knee out from under the tank? You prop the tank with how, how much gas is in it? He ran it just about empty. Okay. You got both straps off. Hey, yeah. I've, I've done that. Yeah, you know, I wasn't standing around here dilly I was working. Oh my god, <laughs> get the <laughs> out of here. I don't know who's you're blowing up somebody's <laughs> Gas. Yeah. And you're like, okay, now what the hell do I, I would never have tempted that, but he said it's fuel and it feel like come on on the way over here about six miles ago. So I'm like, okay. And can you get it from that side, Wayne? And you gotta like, how far yeah. down you gotta drop the tank? Well, the I, most tanks will you can get to the you can get to the filler strap neck. You can't with this one. I was thinking if it let me drop it down far enough, it won't. It's In not, my truck, I had a, I had to disconnect from up here and drop so that. See, I'm not seeing. Hey Wayne, oh, see if you can open that. See, oh, see, open that, Tony, and see if you can unhook it from up there. I would not recommend this. This is the right way to do it, but if you're an idiot, oh, this is how it gets done. Oh, that's good, Wayne. Thank you. Ah. Oh. <laughs> See, it's about indifferent at the moment. So. I'm like sticking directly in front of your face. That's okay. I, this I really I, I'm not looking at it. I'm kind of just doing it. Exactly what your camera is, right down to the bat. <laughs> cool. Sorry, what size you got? Yellow. Yeah. I have no idea. I couldn't read it, man. The one that it's fits. It's working. It's working. It fits nice. It's the right one. So what does this do? Okay, what we're doing now is this will release the filler neck, so it can come down. We can drop it out through the frame rail. Then we can pull the tank down, unplug the fuel or unplug the fuel line that comes from the engine. Then we can unplug the power support, the source. Then we can pull the fuel tank out here on the floor, which you'll see in a little bit, hopefully. And then we can get, then we can change the fuel, the fuel pump assembly unit, which is this guy right here. For people that need the part number, it's an E7198M, and it's an Aerotex unit. Have you looked up in there? There it goes. Uh, <laughs> How's that taste, John? Oh my God. Like PA road oh, salt. God. Okay, go ahead, Wayne. Set it down. You got another black line coming from the front and back on the tank. What? You got another black line coming from the front of the truck back here on the tank. I'm looking right at it. Yeah, right here? Yeah, it's, if you come back, probably you'll find the T. Yeah, it's right here. Can you reach in here and pop it or no? Let it down a little, Wayne. I can't see how it unplugs. Okay, let's see here now. 
So why did you want to see? I'm watching. I'm gonna, I'm gonna move this jack around. Right. All the way across the beltway to my house. Oh, yeah, you did? Yep, and I didn't care. Down to the floor, man. It, uh, it screamed. It screamed at the top of its lungs. Going at the house. The snow thrower attachment out of the back. Pull oh, the, the center console. Pull the boot. Four bolts out. Pull it up. That makes sense. <laughs> the, the, you know the fingers, the forks. linkage fingers. Yeah, all the forks were just. <laughs> they were all bent to sh. So there it is. I'm, I'm in here with a with a torch, <laughs> heating them up and uh, with a pair of vice grip. This little focus comes around me. I'm driving his truck. Behind there. Me. Comes around me like I'm standing. Still, he's like, Fuck. The part number is the same. On the door. Uh, I, he's a half mile ahead of me. I hear that. Yeah, this one has part number on it. <laughs> Here's part number. Oh, they're gonna be. They're gonna vary. Now he took the well, his E7198M. One one M. Part numbers always vary. Is there a reason they vary? It's just newer part. Okay. It's never the same part number. That's factory. That little fucker will shit and get, man. But it's all the same. It all hooks up the same. You're good to go. Hey, everything lines up. Your floats are in the same spot. The ball's back in. <laughs> it worked great, man. Although... At 65 going down the interstate, you'd get a whistle. Mm -hmm. through, through, oh. No, a whistle through the rubber. <laughs> uh, relax. <laughs> yeah. Yep, so I put the crease in the, in the spray foam so it would expand all the way. But that works. Right after that, I had that thing. I went through two trannies, and then uh, I blew the last tranny trying to teach the kid how to drive. And I finally went, yeah, no. Threw it in the paper. 800 bucks or best offer. I had four now, guys Does that show lock up in back. there, or is it just oh, the ring that holds it in? Ball. Uh, yeah, I'm like, yeah. It just should lock down in there. I the street arch going over your Bronco. I said, okay. So I, I pull up, get out, walk across the street, get the run. I said, run. Down. I said, Great. The problem is, is, you got to keep your foot on the brake and turn on the gas. I said, it won't stay idling when you go to stop it. Stop trying to get a red light. But other than that, I'll smoke off the tire off going down the road. Took, here you go. Everybody took it for a drive through the neighborhood, came back. The guys were like, oh, oh, oh. I said, listen, I, this is the way it goes. Bullshit walks. Cash talks. First one back here with 500 bucks cash takes it. That's it. The one, two, everybody running. all jumped in. They're, they were all gone. Everybody pulled back up a couple minutes later. And they're all, this, that, that, the other thing. I said, yeah. So they bid, they bid it out. Dude, they bid it back at 650. <laughs> here you go. Here's the news. <laughs> so let's go down to the title. He did. Everybody was just looking for a winter beater. The guy was. Chop them all and shit anyway and use them for off road vehicles. Yep. You know? That's all Jeremy does now. Oh, I'll tell you what, both those shoes were nice, man, because you could really throw it like a little bit of 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 a little bit Brought a tree down, blew one of the windows out of the back corner of it, and then the roof. He's like, motherfucker. Oh, <laughs> it actually looks really nice. Yeah. The strap, he's, he's, like, got, he's got a bend in it. Right, but that here, might help here, me there. here's my question. There's two studs that stick down and go inside the tank in the front that line up. Okay. Are they in place? Because if not, you're not pushed. You, the tank might not be up all the way for you to have Can you curl up there and look quick? Okay, hi guys. Here we are again. We got this done. It, as you could see, it wasn't as easy as we said it'd be, but it was fairly simple. So please, please don't hesitate to try this yourselves. So feel more than free. Uh, we gave you the part number. We, we'll link that in the video. So have fun. Good luck, and give it a shot.